going to approve the minutes from November 21st. Um, if you'd please take a look at those minutes. And do we have, um, I'll ask for first of all a, a motion to move these minutes. Anybody make a motion for that? I make the motion. Okay, Brian makes the motion. Who seconds? Second. Second by Mike Pluff. Any changes on page one? Page two? Page three? Page four? Hang on. Uh, on page five, Barbara. Page under, four. Okay, page four, Tim. There's a box there that says motion Daniel Augustine to bring forward to the public hearing. Yes. There was no motion to bring forward to the public hearing. It was just a motion. Okay, strike. <coughs> motion. Just, just a general statement there. We had a problem a couple of years ago when that kind of language got into our minutes. Uh -huh. And we actually made a change prior to the public hearing. Yeah. Uh, as you recall, it caused some people to complain rather loudly okay. about us pulling surprise changes. So okay. we cannot have that language, Barbara, in there ever okay. on a motion. Because we we're just moving it forward. We're not moving it forward to any place. Okay. So it's the word that should come out, the words that should come out are? Move forward it's, it's, uh, to the public hearing. Okay. So just take out to bring forward. Didn't we just do that with the last set of minutes? I thought well, so. it was something different, actually. But okay, but similar. It, it, it seems like it was the same wording to bring forward. Yeah. Okay. No, it had to. It had to do with some uh, discussion. Okay. Well, and in this case, on page four okay. of page of uh, of the draft, uh, the motion by Danielle. Just take out the words to bring forward, please. Anything else on page four? Uh, excuse me. Yes. Um. You want to read it through? You, you take out, take to out bring the word, forward. To, to take out the first three words to bring forward. That's all. Yep. To okay. bring forward to public hearing, that all goes away. To bring forward to the public hearing. Okay, that all goes away. So the motion okay. should say, Tim, start with the sum of X amount of money. Well, it, it's right at the top of that. Uh, as I recall, anyway, it's right. Yeah, number four, which is on page one, I guess, bottom page one. Um, motion for the FY 2018 Department of Public Works okay. proposed budget in the amount of block. That's that's exactly the wording that should be in the box as well. Okay. All right. So just make that change, Barbara. Anything else on four? Page five. I want to point out on page five under uh, Village District number eight. Um, Mr. Ladd said designers and musicians were working on the Christmas float. Please change Xmas. That's, I don't want that in there. Barbara, make sure that that's changed. Yes, I got that. Uh, One minute. We're not going to use Xmas, not as long as I'm the chair of this board. What page? Page five. Can I go back to four? Yes, you can go back to four. Uh, After. After Barbara acknowledges that she can see well, what I'm talking about. Yeah. So what are you calling the float? It's called the Christmas float. Christmas spelled out. Yes, not Xmas. Okay. Please. Thank you. Go ahead, Tim. Page four. Again. Yeah. Um, that last part in there, it, it, I was trying to call for sensitivity about how we use public TV. I don't think that was uh, that's reflective in that sentence, um, in the last sentence on page four. So I'm happy you just strike it out or, or, or word it in such a way that it captures that essence that I was saying about being sensitive about not using public television as a campaigning vehicle. I remember that conversation and I I said something to the okay. effect that it wasn't for so much campaigning, it was for informational or educational type of thing. Purpose. I still favor the more bare bones approach to minutes, so I'd be happy if that comment just, related to me is just removed. Okay, so remove those two lines that Mr. Jones called attention to, and okay. then just remove both lines, please. Okay, that's the easiest thing to do. I agree with you on that, Tim. Simplicity is best. Um, anything else on page four? Page five, page six, okay, 
Um, so, who moved this? There's one other thing now that's to be. Uh, we'll happen. I do. Right. Yeah. Hold on. Right. Second. Okay, Tim. What? There's one other thing relative to the penalty. I got to find it though. The penalty. Yeah. Let me see if I can't. Uh, Section is it in Tom? Uh, yeah, Tom. What section of this? It's on the DPW. DPW. Um, it's right, right after where I said something about sidewalks. I wish I edited this document. In the future, you might want to highlight it or something when you're going through it. At home. Yeah, I had to do before that, so. Okay, the clock is ticking, Tim. Yeah, I'm under pressure. I hear I feel it. <laughs> On page four. In response to Mr. Jones, Miss Hale said that when installed sidewalks will be made ADA compliant. Yeah, the next line after that, what's it say? Although contracts contained a thousand dollar a day fine for going past the deadline, when the town suspended yeah. word the clause would not apply. What page is that on? It's on four. That's what I thought it was. Right to on my it's eyes. the second paragraph from the top. See, th th those two lines read as one paragraph, as though they were one subject. How would you like it to read? Um, uh, those, it should be two paragraphs those are two, two subjects. Those yeah. are two separate things. So right. yeah. you need to put and a space at the end of that. In response to Mr. Jones, uh, sidewalks were made ADA compliant. Put a space, Barbara, so it, could, no. it makes a new Make it a paragraph. paragraph. Yeah. Okay. And then the, then the next one, it says, although contracts contained a $1,000 a day fine, it wasn't contracts. It was the Lafayette Road uh, reconstruction contract. That contained a one hundred a uh, one thousand dollar day fine. Sewer contract. Whatever whatever you want to call that contract. Uh, it was Lafayette Road, that's all I call it. Okay. Yeah. Um, so going past the deadline. And when the town suspended the contract, they suspended that clause as well. Well it, they actually that's suspended what I said. they suspended the work. Right. It says work. No. But it should say no. suspended the work because it's gonna start again in the no. spring. The selectman didn't suspend the work. The selectman suspended the contract. Okay, well, it says word, so... so no, it shouldn't. It should and that's say, not what I said, either. Okay, then tell her exactly what it should say, because... Although the Lafayette Road contract contained a $1,000 a day fine for going past the deadline, when the selectman suspended the contract, they also suspended that penalty clause. Right. Okay. Is that clear to you, Barbara? Jennifer agreed... And I said that, thank you, my constituent is now satisfied with his request of me to bring it up. Yeah, but that's not in there. We're not going to add that. Well, that's what I said. I know. So I'm saying We're it again. Put it. So do you have the gist of what he's talking about, Barbara? Yeah. Thank you. Anything else for, any, for I anybody? I hope not. Okay. In that case, uh, we have a motion by... By uh, Brian, Brian. seconded second. by uh, Mike Pluff. All those in favor of accepting these minutes? Everybody except all those not a, not, and then a, 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 abstaining is Ginny because she wasn't here. Yeah, I'm going to abstain because I wasn't here. Steve Henderson also abstained because he wasn't here. Everyone else approved it. All right, next on Kenneth. the yes, sir. On the minutes. Yes. Uh, we were also emailed the so called. Final minutes of nine. November 9th. Uh huh. And it contains still the watermark of drafts. I noticed that, Barbara. It, it still said draft on it. Did it? Yeah. Um, and I, I did. And, 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 the, and the problematic to bring forward to public hearing is still in the box there uh, as well uh, that we discussed earlier. All right. Could you um, go back, Barbara, and check that on the November 9th min minutes? Remove the the draft. It's, the, it's, it's the it's the title of the of the section is correct for the motion, but what you put in the box with the vote is uh, 
worded differently and it includes that offenses to bring forward to public hearings. Hold on one minute. Let me find it. So we need to actually revisit the minutes. From uh, at a subsequent meeting or now, it's up to you. I, don't, I just well, wanted to highlight that that was there. Let's just get it done right now because it's too <coughs> Okay. It's pretty quick. <coughs> So the watermark has to come off. The watermark comes off, and then in the boxes where it says to be brought forth or bring forward to the public to bring hearing. Forward, the just, yeah. just make the same change. All references to public hearing should not exist. Okay. So just go through and make those changes again, and then it'll it'll be a final, and you can send it to me again as a final, okay. and I'll send it off to uh, to be posted properly. Okay. 